guys, welcome back to my channel. And this is going to be a small haul from the new pound world in Hyde. So me and my dad actually nicked there, I think it was yesterday. Um, so yeah, I've got a few things, mainly fake nails. Um, I did get some doggy toys and treats and whatnot, but my puppy's got them. <laughs> and at the minute she's... How can I explain it? She's teething, basically. So I got her this teething ring. I can't show it yet because she's going mental with it right now because she is teething really bad. So, yeah. Um, also, Roxy is going to be doing um, a toy haul. Her very own first toy haul. Yes, that's right. You heard it here first. A puppy doing her first toy haul video. <laughs> so, yeah, she's going to be doing that. But for now, I'm going to show you everything that I got from this new pan world that has just opened in Hyde. Um, and I went in, and I'll tell you what, it's actually pretty good. I like it in there. So me and my dad are going to be going in there on a regular basis to have a look, basically, see what new stock to keep getting in. So let's get into this haul anyway, because it's what we're here for. So I'll show you the boring stuff first. So basically, I've got some simple nail polish remover in this brand right here. I've never heard of this brand before. Um, nothing spectacular about nail polish remover, let's face it, so that's that. One pound, of course. Now, even though it did say pound world, there is some things that are just a little bit over a pound, like two pound, I noticed, which I thought was fairly odd, but there we go. Anyway, the next thing, the next boring, I'd say the boringest thing that I got is this pack of batteries. <laughs> I need them for my um, my rose lights on my bed. So yeah, I've got to put some of them in tonight. And the other boring thing is basically simple handy wipes. You get 20 in a pack and they are berry scented. And they are shimmer and shine. And I thought these were super duper cute. I thought I had to get them. They're so girly. They're childish. They're so me. I love them. I'm just going to chuck one of these in my handbag. And away I go. And these was only 50p each. So that's why I got two to make a pound. I thought that was really, really cool. And then, uh, when we went on holiday, my niece actually told me about this really, really good brush. Detangling brush. Because when I get my hair wet and I try brushing my hair, it like rips too much hair out. It's pretty scary for me. Um, I do think a lot of my hair. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, anyway, she's advised me to get the Tame Tangles a detangling brush, basically. And it's like this. I got the pink one. I think they did this in white and blue, I think. But I wanted the girly, girly one. Why not? I don't mind this colour pink. I love it. Okay, so this brush has specially tame your tangles. Teeth that will glide through wet or dry. So, yeah, it's supposed to reduce, this one is supposed to reduce hair falling out. Um, I have tried it already. I know naughty of me before I did this video, but, you know, I got a little bit excited about it and I had to try it. Um, now, I brushed my hair with it when it was dry. Not a lot of hair came out. I brushed it when it was wet and just a bit came out. And it detangles so, so good. I even got my mum to brush my hair with it when I when it was wet. And my mum was like, wow, this is really, really good. You should get a backup. For a pound, I'm going to get two. So I'm going to get two backups because I'm a bugger for breaking brushes. But um, yeah, let's take this out and have a look. So as I say, it was a pound. Just looks like this. There's your bristles. And uh, it says the name there. It's not that goodly made, if I'm being honest. I mean, you can run your finger there and you can feel it all sticking up. It's not very goodly made, but it is a really good brush. Uh, so I'm happy with this one. So I'm going to get two of these for backup. So I could take one on holiday and in case I break one or something at home. At least I've got two backups. And then I'm going to go somewhere like Boots and get a really expensive, really top-notch quality one. Because, yeah, I'm not happy with how this is all sharp around there. So anyway, that's that. So now I'm going to get on to all the nail, you know, the um, false nails. Now some of these were a pound, some of them were one pound fifty. So I'll show you the one pound fifty first. Uh, think, I think these were the one pound fifty. I'm not, I can't quite remember. 
to be honest, so we're just going to get into it. So basically they had a collection of Little Mix nails. Um, now I didn't get them because I like Little Mix. I'm not bothered about Little Mix. I don't mean to disrespect anybody, but I'm not that bothered. But the nails are absolutely beautiful. So the first nails that I've got, which are my least favourite, are these ones and they are them. They have like a tuxedo kind of pattern on. I don't know if you can see that. They have like a love heart, tuxedo, more love hearts, a bow, glitter, stuff like that. So that's them. Then they have these ones. Now these are freaking awesome. Wait till you see these. Okay. Then they have these skulls on, like sugar candy skull. They are so freaking cool. And some of these... Um aren't glue um aren't glue some of these you have to put the sticky stuff on but they haven't already got them on you have to put it on yourself but i'm not going to do that i'm just going to glue them suckers straight on so yeah that's them ones and then the last ones which are my favorite out of every single pack that i've got are the fruity ones and they are my favorite out of all of them so then the other ones that i got are these these are the last ones, and we got some Love Heart Balloons, which I just thought would be super acute, super, super adorable. Tongue twister, super adorable for um, Valentine's Day, or if I'm going on a date. So yeah, they're really, really cool. And the next ones are the Easter Chick. And yeah, because I'm on a diet. I thought I might not be able to have a lot of chocolate for Easter, but I can spoil myself with some beautiful nails. And then the next ones I got are, these are my favourites. Again, this is like my second favourite. And these are pineapples. Aren't they just adorable? Beautiful. I'm going to save these for summer. Next year, of course, because we've had a really pooey summer this year. And that's it. That is everything that I got for this haul. So yeah, if you haven't yet been into the Hyde Pound World, take yourself in there because they have got some gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. They had more nails than this, but this was like all that was catching my eye for now, really. Um, plus I was more interested in getting my puppy stuff. So yeah. So there the... Nails, don't know how well I'm doing that. <laughs> Hold on. <gasps> Dropping in. So yeah, I've got quite a few videos coming up. Anyway, there's the nails. All um, do, 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 do. Really, really cool. Now I've got to go put all this away. Uh, so yeah, I do like that pound shop. There's some lovely stuff in there, as I say. We've got some lovely house, like little bits and bobs for the house, like candles and all, et cetera, et cetera. I did notice that they've started bringing Christmas stuff out. Love, love, love Christmas. Christmas and Halloween are like two of my favourite times of the year. Christmas is my all-time big, big favourite. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave it there, guys, anyway. Get your booty into that new pound shop because it really is a nice pound shop. We're going to be going in there quite a lot now. Um, yeah, so I'm going to leave it there. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you like this video. Comment down below if you have been into the new pound world yet. Um, yeah, <laughs> tell me what you think. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in a bit. Bye.